So in celebration of my father, who would have been 75, I decided to make a nice family meal, and here I am making stuffing. And this spoon is actually whittled out of uh, wood. My nono in Italy made it, um, and I've been using it ever since. Here are some buns that I'm gonna put in the oven. <laughs> and this is a chicken dish I like to make. Um, most of my family likes dark meat and the leg of the chicken, so why not just buy legs? So what I do is I take some chicken legs, sorry about the messy oven, and some broccoli, and I drizzle some olive oil, breadcrumbs, and garlic, and it is so delicious. So I'll be making that with the stuffing, and here I am making the cake. Um, so hopefully I don't bake, hopefully this will be okay. So I'm about to pour it into the pan, and hopefully this will be okay. And. Um, have my balloons that we're gonna let go later on to say happy birthday in heaven and in the oven it goes and here i am finally resting and beating I'm gonna make another purse charm with some beads that i got at michael's as the dogs here relax and my mom's puppy is relaxing checking on the cake and apparently i used too many eggs hopefully this turns out well <laughs> And here is how one of them came out. I'm calling this my pasta fazool one, or as my father would say, pasta fagioli. Because <laughs> there's a little bit of everything. We have little coins and pearls and lots of um, inspirational charms and a cross. It just felt very, you know, religious today. And it's just super chunky super heavy and it's beautiful almost too beautiful to put on a handbag just almost use as a whimsical um piece a focal piece you know just to hang but anyway so that's this and i also made a more practical one <laughs> with the greens and there's this one so this is what i have been doing today we are going to do the balloons, and I kept busy in remembrance of my dad, and um, that's about it. So I hope everyone has a wonderful and blessed Sunday evening.